With only four rounds left in the season, Sale, who are on the verge of a top four finish, visited Worcester, who are fighting to avoid relegation, a game where both teams were anxious to win for differing reasons. The home side were on the front foot from the first whistle, with Sam Lewis breaking Sale's defensive line in the sixth minute. Duncan Weir converted the try. He then followed up with a penalty in the tenth minute to make the score 10-0. The Warriors were outstanding in the opening quarter of the match and Bryce Heen gathered momentum with a great offload to full-back Chris Pennell, who touched down for the second try of the match. Duncan Weir's right foot was working well too. Worcester into a 17-0 lead after just 19 minutes. Sale finally got a toehold with half-time in sight. Rohan Janser van Rensburg working a bit of magic to open up space for Josh Beaumont to get Sale onto the scoreboard. AJ McGinty's conversion made it 17-7 at half-time. Worcester stalled the sale comeback early in the second half with a Duncan Weir penalty, though that was cancelled out soon after when a high tackle on Denny Solomona handed McGinty the kick that reduced the deficit to 10 points again. Cue the Josh Adams show and his first ever hat-trick for the Warriors. The first two were classic team tries, which was the theme of a glorious afternoon for Worcester. The second, which sealed the try bonus point. On 66 minutes, Bryce Heem was sent to the Simbin for a tip tackle on Paolo Odogwu. And Sale took advantage of Matt Postlethwaite charging down Weir's clearance. But it was Worcester who finished with a flourish. Adams clinching his hat-trick try in the final minute and the full five points for Worcester. Final score, Worcester 39, Sale Shark 17.